Hello, Doll Bedsit Blogger here. I'm with Gimpy, and it's just gone the 15th of November, so that must mean it's time for me to reveal the winners of my competition for winning a jar of Gimpy's Special Reserve Maruga Marmalade. So I had three people enter into this competition, which kind of puts me in a difficult position because I actually had two jars that I could give away, but it's still, oh, it's not enough. So shall we have a look and uh, we'll see who entered and who has got a prize? Because everyone wins a prize in a dull bedsit blogger competition. We had a very scary entry from Mr. Frizz42. Gimpy's Special Reserve Marugo Marmalade. Gimpy's Special Reserve Marugo Marmalade. Mr. Frizz has a, a great little channel where he does uh, chili reviews and they're very much um, all about the flavour kind of chili reviews. They're not the, uh, he, he, I'm big and macho, I'm having a ton of really strong stuff and my head's going to fall off and i got to shit blood for a week. Jimpy's Special Reserve Maruga Then there's Star 11 Guru Which um Ah uh, Now Mr. Star 11 Guru You are obviously an evil mastermind who carefully reads everything You, you, you are wise You are wise So uh yes uh, Mr. Style 11 Guru, he um, he does chilli reviews as well, he's reviews a few uh, sauces and bits. And now we have Mr. Gav 666. Here we go. Give me special reserve, Marie Give me special reserve, Marie Give me special reserve. Marie he's a crazy bearded guy, isn't he? And he's uh, the bass player in The Sapien. <sighs> Um, which is a uh, fantastic manly metal band. Uh, you can there'll be a download link down below for their EP. Go and check it out and have a look at their videos. What are our prize winners going to win? Obviously, I only have two of these, and there was three entries, and I don't want anyone to leave home empty-headed. So, um, what I'm going to do, Mr. Fritz. 42, he wins a jar. Uh, Style 11 Guru, you win a jar. Now, here comes Mr. Gav 666. I know you, you quite like your chilies. So I'm going to send you so, a selection of some um, of my homegrown chilies, including a Nagla. <gasps> a Nagla? Oh my word, they're so. Uh, it's so gnarly. Um, and I can tell, I can tell, Mr. Fritz and Style 11 Guru, you're feeling left out. You want Nagler's too. You get Nagler's, you get Nagler's. Oh, no one leaves this place empty headed. Um, and oh no, now, now I can hear Mr. Gav666 going, ooh. But they get marmalade. I just get some chilies. I get the same chilies. Fear not. My good friends at China Spice Co.uk gave me a lovely package of stuff. And so I'm going to um, put together a package of Exian Horn dried chilies. Facing Heaven bullet and finger uh, chilies and some Dragon's Back chilies. A packet of red Szechuan flower peppers and a packet of green Szechuan flower peppers. And a packet of Marpo tofu sauce, which you may have seen the video of me cooking stuff with it.
all of that, all from chinaspice.co.uk. Wow, wow, that's good. Oh, oh no. I can hear Style Guru 11, or uh, Style 11 Guru going, yeah, yeah, that's all right. I've got that stuff. But I can hear Mr. Fitz. I can hear Mr. Fritz going, oh, I like that stuff. You can have that stuff too. Now, 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 I can hear Style 11 Guru going, oh, but Mr. Fritz has got extra stuff. Well, I've not got extra stuff. Well, I've got extra stuff. Dry your tears. Dry your tears, Style 11 Guru. I'm going to send you a copy of Godspunk 11. Yeah, Godspunk 11. The fantastic experimental music compilation featuring the large range of members. And Neil by Mo. So, uh, yeah. You can have that. And I'm also going to chuck in some um, Las Vegas Mermaids postcards and stickers and a uh, Silverman porno playing card for each of you. Oh, yes. So, who can say that the Dull Bedsit blog is not generous? <gasps> wow. With the magic of video editing, a plate has appeared. Which means... I'm going to do a taste test on the second batch of Maruga marmalade that I made. Uh, this one I've named Dark Matter, Gimpy's Dark Matter. And uh, with this one, you can see, have a look at that. It's a lot darker. I used some uh, mol uh, dark molasses sugar in the uh, making process. I also added some more um, orange peel and lemon. And uh, yes, I've made this very dark um, Maruga marmalade, uh, which I, I, I tried a little bit when I was making it, but I've, I've let it settle for a while. Um, there aren't any of these available. These are going to be sort of kind of Christmas presents. So, oh, this is uber limited edition. Eventually, one day, these will be collected by the uh, collectors of out of date chili products, um, if any are left. Uh, so let's give it a taste. Smells quite um, rich. So, when I was making this, uh, because I'd added quite a few, few extra bits, I had some problems with its setting, so I had to re boil it with a bit of apple and some rhubarb in there just to uh, add some extra pet kin pet add some extra pectin Whew, that's tricky um so this is the first one that has been set that i've tried and uh, let's give it a go it's very thick there there oh look at that loads of bits there oh like nice loads of peel in there I, and that's what I really like about a good marmalade lots of peel now crazily I think Gimpy's been really pleased with the marmalade because Gimpy has started popping out flowers which are tickled not thinking that they'd come into to anything and uh, Gimpy has a couple of new chilies growing which uh, which would be good I've, I've still got a few little red ones on here. I'm hoping to make another batch of uh, Maruga marmalade. Um, I don't know what the difference will be with this one. I've got a couple of ideas, but we'll see what happens. Let's see. So, got the uh, got the marmalade on there. Let's. Uh... Oh, that's good. It's got a this one is a lot more orangey than the last one. It's got a bit more of a, a bit more heat to it, a bit more of a "oh, I'm gonna get ya" kind of thing. But it's still not um, it's not overwhelming. A lot more of a kind of mature marmalade flavour to it, but with the added burn of the Maruga uh, of the Maruga chili, I'm pretty pleased with that. 